good afternoon everyone welcome back with me Krishna again in this channel channel that always gives you the information about places in Bali with the update situation how are you today I hope you're doing good stay safe and healthy wherever you are okay today I'm here in Ubud this is the center of Ubud and now it's about almost six o'clock so since I'm passing by in this street I would like to stop here for a while and let's walk along this street guys this is Jalan Raya Ubud, let's see what is happening and also later I will show you the Ubud Market and Ubud Palace so don't go anywhere and let's watch until the end of this video okay so this is the situation at Jalan Raya Ubud as you can see a lot of scooters, parking and also cars and a lot of people also roaming around in this area we're really glad to see that and a lot of businesses are open and here in front of us is the spa is open I think it's Christian spa have you been to that spa? it looks nice from outside and look at this here guys there are a lot of people roaming around here driving scooters you need to be careful when you drive scooters around here because so many people and here, nice uh, stuff, dresses, and etc. Taxi service also available from the local people. So if you need taxi, you can get it from them. But I think you need to know the price or the correct price. Anyway, you can always bargain with them. And here in the front is a nice shop. We call it Fever Shop. They are open. They are selling slippers, basically. And here guys, I think this is gelato. It's a nice place, very cute, I think. And here in the front, anybody know this restaurant? This is Nomad restaurant, guys. They are open and they have some people there enjoying their food and drinks. Okay, let's continue here in the front as you can see a lot of people there and a lot of cars as well and here nice shops are open nice bags here guys it is rotten bag anybody like to have rotten bag and here look at this 65% off or sales so for those of you that like to do some shopping here you may do so here is a dream catcher clothes, dresses and by the way I would like to inform you again regarding the PCR test maybe most of you know already or have seen the news from the TV or social media that our president in his speech on 17th of May he announced that if you are fully vaccinated you don't need to have pre PCR test or PCR test before you come to Bali guys this is really big news because I know most of you need to pay quite a lot of money to do PCR test before you come to Bali. So now you don't need it anymore. Plus the good things is when you go out in Bali or in the public area or outdoor, you don't need to wear masks anymore. Unless if you are in the room with a lot of people, that is the time that you can wear your mask. And I think this decision is really help for our tourism. So I do really hope our tourism will be back soon like before and more people will visit our island guys. Okay back to the street here. This is a nice restaurant finally today is open. I think if not mistaken the name is Gedong CC restaurant. And that has been closed very long time during this uh, pandemic or COVID-19. But today, as you can see, it's very nice that it's open. And here on the left side, that is the open market. Like I mentioned in a previous video, the open market is under renovations now. So they have destroyed the old buildings. Because of that, now people are selling their stuff by the road like this, guys, like in front of us.
let's have a look closer how is the open market now and here as you can see they have a lot of nice stuff here wood carving, dream catcher, dresses, trousers, batiks and etc so I think if you passing by in this area maybe you like something from here you can ask them the price and you can do some bargaining giving them like one or two sales I think it will be happy for them considering the situations now it's better but not as busy as before COVID-19 of course and a lot of shops there are open which is good to see that because last time I came here most of them were closed so this is the situation in Upward Market guys so if you go straight here you will go to the street lead you to go to Jalan Dewi Sita I think as you can see guys in the front there is no more market or no more buildings Okay, let's continue. So I would like to show you the situations here as well. This is Jalan Suweta nearby the Ubud Palace. As you can see in front of us, the Indian Cousins restaurant still remaining closed. But next to it, Milk and Madu restaurant is open. It's quite busy as well. It is good to see that. And this is the center of Ubud. And here on the left side is the Ubud Palace, later I will uh, come there to have a look. Maybe most of you know already about this Ubud Palace, especially if you stay around here in Ubud. But for those of you that haven't been to this Ubud Palace, this is how it looks like. They have a nice gate there and a lot of people like to take picture there. And now every weekend or Saturday they will have kind of like a dance like a uh, leg on dance and that will start around 7 o'clock or 7 30 and for the tickets it's about 100,000 rupiah guys. to see the dance Okay, let's continue. Let's walk a little bit to uh, Monkey Forest Street. Let's see what is happening there. And I need to cross the road here. And in front of us, as you can see, they have nice stuff as well. Look at these guys. A lot of uh, mirror, mask, clothes, and etc. So where I'm walking now, this is John and Monkey Forest, which is a one-way street. And here, nice to see some tourists walking around on the sidewalk. And if you need any fruits, you can get it from here. So this is Ratan bag guys, it is nice and nice to see some people having conversation with the sellers, doing some bargaining, which is good I think. And maybe please don't bargain too hard guys, because I think giving them that one or two sales, it will be very happy for them. But as you see the situations here in Ubud Center, I think it's really much better compared than last time I came here. It was like a few days or a week ago. A lot of people, a lot of cars and scooters passing by. another gelato and here as you can see this is the Bollywood Indian cuisine so if you like to try Indian food 
I think you can come and visit them. And there at the opposite side, I think that is the tropical restaurant. You can see from here they have some guests, which is good to see that. Okay everyone, that's all for today. A short video actually from Ubud Center. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to support me by subscribing to this channel. See you again in the next video. Thank you very much and bye now.